What is going on, everybody? My name is Pete, and you guys are watching Paid to Drive and Pay to Drive Vlogs. Hope you guys are doing fantastic out there. If you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats, or any of the others, you, my friends, are in the right place to stay up to date with what's going on in the gig economy. So get started right now for free. Hit that red subscribe button down below. Turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And if you wouldn't mind, hit that like button down below. Just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. In fact, leave a comment right now saying liked, just so I know you did it. And let's jump into it. All right, drivers and dashers. Got a long one here, so listen up. <clears throat> this comes from Mark, and he says the following. Hey, Pete, my name is Mark. Earlier this morning, when it was busy on the DoorDash platform, I was on an active dash in Bay City, Michigan. Now this happened to me two orders in the same hour. I recently heard about dashers getting paused randomly and had not experienced this until now. So I picked up an order from Wendy's and when I completed the drop off, my dash was paused immediately after completing the order. So usually in my market during the busy time after I complete an order, I will immediately get another order with no wait. A few minutes went by and I was still not receiving any orders, so this was kind of weird and unusual for me. So I looked at my map and started driving to the nearest hotspot, which ended up being McDonald's about four miles away. When I got to the McDonald's, I parked and waited for a few minutes and then I got an order from Tim Hortons. I picked up that order and completed it and the same thing happened again. I then got a great cracker barrel for $10.75 for about four miles. I accepted it and I was on my way to make the delivery. When I completed that order, it happened again. I was paused immediately after completing the order. So I hit the resume dash and I wasn't receiving any new orders. So I drove down the street and got some drinks and snacks at the local gas station. <clears throat> Still no orders coming in. So I started driving home so I could use the restroom and take a little break. I pulled in my driveway and waited for a few minutes and still no orders. So by this time, about 10 to 15 minutes had gone by with no orders. Granted, right before I started my dash, I received a text that DoorDash was busy in my area and I should log in now and start dashing if I wanted to. Keep in mind, I currently have top dasher status as well. So I usually don't wait very long before I started receiving uh, orders, even when it's slow. My acceptance rate is kind of low right now, so maybe that has something to do with it. I don't know. I'm at a current rate of 57%. I was super frustrated with this, so I just ended my dash and decided to go back out later when it was busier. The funny thing, after I end my dash, and as usual, within 10 minutes, I received another text saying it was busy and I can dash now if I choose. Anyway, I called customer support because I was still frustrated about getting paused. As usual, the customer support rep is someone outsourced from another country who speaks very poor English and made me repeat myself like six times telling him about my issue with getting paused. How many times have we heard that language barrier problem, guys? His response to my issue was to ask me if I could still dash and still deliver. I said yes, but I don't like completing orders and getting randomly paused afterwards. I already waited through the queue and was making deliveries. It's my experience that once you make your first delivery and went through the queue system that you usually don't have any wait time at all. While getting paused twice in an hour and having to start back over in the queue system when I know it's busy and I'm not receiving any orders is just too much for me right now. I was already ti tired and hadn't slept much because I was trying to push it the last day of the week, but I didn't want to just sit there and wait for it to get busy again. Feel free to share this and you can use my name. I also would like you to know I appreciate you, Pete, and your efforts to keep us fellow dashers informed. I currently use the DoorDash platform for a full-time income right now, and I have made it my daily routine that I wake up an hour before my dash and watch all your recent videos so I can keep in mind what's happening and currently going on in the gig economy. For now, I am solely using DoorDash, but I am currently in the process of signing up to Uber Eats and will probably sign up Grubhub in the near future. 
I heard from a few people that the other platform forms were dead in my area. So with that being said, uh, the email continues on a little bit more, but this was pretty much the brunt of it. Uh, of course, I just want to say thank you, Mark, for the, the compliments that you find the videos helpful. That's what it's there for. Um, I have not heard of this situation. I've heard of drivers being paused um, from rejecting too many offers, and then they log you out or end your dash or you have to click resume, but not where it's you complete an order, then you get paused, then you have to hit resume, then you do another order you complete it, then they pause you and you hit resume. I have not seen or heard about that yet. So drivers, dashers, let me know down below in the comments or the chat. Are you experiencing this situation? And can you relate to what Mark is talking about here? And of course, if you ever have anything you want to share with me, a comment, a question, a topic, a story, an article, whatever it is, be sure to send it to me at paid to drive stories at gmail.com. Also, for a quicker response, you guys can always reach out and message me through Patreon at patreon.com forward slash paid to drive. That link is in the description down below or in the pin top comment. And anyone who signs up as a patron as my way of saying thank you is I give you guys shout outs in all my new videos. And as you can see, there are all the names right here on your screen of our current patrons as of the current moment of this video being made so huge shout outs to all of them if you guys want to sign up links are down below as i mentioned who's going to be the next patron maybe it will be you and of course i hope every single one of you out there is saving lots of money on your gas using the free gas app called get upside the link is in the description down below just scroll down this page and click on the link that says get the free gas app it's very simple to use it'll tell you how to install it on whatever kind of phone tablet or device that you have and then from that point all you got to do is go to your gas station pump your gas print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside Gas app, and within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside. Links in the description down below. Make sure to download it today. And finally, for all your t-shirts, hoodies, and goodies, visit paidtodrivestore.com. That link is in the description, and you guessed it, the pin top comment down below. We've got lots of great new designs, colors, sizes, you name it. We probably have it on sale every day at paidtodrivestore.com. That link is in the description down below and the pin top comment. And of course, if you made it to the end of this video, I'm extremely grateful for all of you. Let me know by leaving a comment in the chat or the comment section below saying end 100, E-N-D 100. Just lets me know you did it. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And if you wouldn't mind it, hit that like button down below just lets me know you enjoyed the video and it lets YouTube know that I'm doing a good job. In fact, leave a comment right now saying liked L I K E D just so I know you did it. And until next time, get that money, get that honey, keep hustling and keep bustling. And we'll see you next time right here on paid to drive and paid to drive logs. And as always drive safe, be well, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace.